So I want to guarantee the integrity of a file system. I want to guarantee that I have a file system that only owners of files can change them. Okay? Uh, everybody can read. I don't want to guarantee secrecy, but only owners of files can change them. Okay? So I input uh, uh, a file name uh, with the, my identity. Uh, then the system or the ID service records uh, associate this file name with my identity. Uh, and when I ask the, uh, the system uh, uh, to write, W write to this file name with some update contents with, my, uh, with some UID, uh, then if uh, uh, this uh, UID prime equals the UID, where UID is the UID that's in the file name, so then, uh, uh, then update uh, correspondingly. Else I'm going to return an error message, an error code. So here I actually return an error code. And when I get an input uh, to read uh, a file name, then actually, uh, um, then I'm going to leak it to S. Only when I read, this is the choice here of the functionality, right? You can do it in other ways. Then I actually leak it to S. And when S says, uh, okay, then I return the, the, uh, the content of the file name, right? So, so here I don't, uh, uh, right? So now let me draw it. Uh, okay, this takes time. Uh, so, um, so this is my F. Okay, so um, uh, when if I get. Uh, um, and this, when, when I get uh, here, I get an input, which is a uh, UID F name uh, in it. Oops, sorry. Uh, yeah. I am going to UID in it. Maybe in it should be first. And so in it, okay. Uh, then what I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, uh, record. So what uh, is the value that's in it? And it is just a, it, it's a reserve word. Yeah. Okay, so it's just a reserve word. Okay, then I'm going to write in my, I have a database that I write uh, uh, F name, file name, and UID. This file name is associated with UID. That's my database of F, okay? And, uh, uh, and now, when I get an input, uh, right? And, but notice that, uh, um, okay, so I will, I will say it in a minute. Uh, when I get uh, input UID uh, prime and the write and contents, right? Um, what do I do? I'm checking if, uh, uh, if UID prime and, uh, sorry, and file name. I'm checking if the pair UID prime and F name are in my database, okay? If, you, if, if it's in database, then I'm going to uh, update the content. So, so I'm going to add to my database the F name, UID prime, and the new content, okay? If, uh, if, if there is no such a pair, F name, UID prime, then I return an error, okay? Now, um, now, is not, now the last thing is going to be read. If I get a, a read uh, uh, input, then I'm going to, to read F name uh, um, UID prime. In this case, uh, uh, I'm not checking anything. I'm just going to the database and looking at uh, uh, the, the last entry of this file name and the contents, and I return the contents, okay? Oh, well, actually, no, sorry. That, then I don't do this. Then I, then I have to be uh, 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 more careful, slow, that I'm going to send uh, uh, to the simulator uh, uh, this uh, F name, UID, and content. And when the simulator says, okay, only then I go and I, and I return the contents, right? So I want to allow uh, 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 systems that uh, uh, you kind of Controlled by uh, by the network, so the network can stop 
reading of a file. If I didn't want to allow this, then I wouldn't have it here. Okay. So uh, uh, this is a way to say that I'm not doing any uh, any uh, access control for reading. I'm only doing access control for writing, based on a new idea. Okay. It's going to be easier to write this than the implementation, because the implementation of this. So so this is just a functionality that gives you files. That there's no implementation here. Think of the, the implementation of this is going to be a whole file system with directories and, uh, and, and all, the, all the gory details. And, uh, and you don't want to capture that. And, and actually, there's going to be work in showing that the system actually realizes this simple deal functionality. Now, if you only care about access control, then you can write your system with the assumed of that. You don't, so it is simpler. But it's true. But your point is very true that, that uh, this UC analysis, or this, this type of analysis, only is useful when the specification is much simpler than the implementation. Otherwise, uh, uh, it, it's not for nothing. Well, it's, it's a good point, because not always, it's not always obvious that this is the case. 